Eyes were glued on the events in Charlottesville. The Balch Springs community was setting an example for the rest of the country to follow. Here's Channel 8's Hannah Davis. Like so many people across the country, the people here have been watching what's going on in Charlottesville. And they say this party, this gathering, feels like a breath of fresh air, something they needed. But they also say if this community can come together after everything it's been through, well, this should set an example for the rest of the country. Easy, Dre, easy, easy. Like any proud mom, Teresa Stevens came here to cheer on her son. Defense. But she also came here to cheer on her hometown, Balch Springs, a city that's been hurting for the last four months. It's tragic, it's sad, but no system is shut down and we need the police. We need the officers and they need us as well. In April, 15 year old Jordan Edwards was shot and killed by a police officer leaving a party. Edwards was unarmed in a passenger seat of a car as it drove away. The officer has since been fired and charged with murder, and the city has looked for ways to heal. We can all come together, but it takes effort. Everyone has to want it. This end of summer party is one step forward, hosted by police, the fire department, and the city. It's about coming together regardless of of anything going on, regardless of if we agree or disagree, we always come together and we have a common objective and that's unity in our community. Police Chief Jonathan Haber says Balch Springs has an opportunity to set an example for the rest of the country. This community responds differently than the way the nation does and, and I'm so proud of it. I could have lived anywhere. I chose to live here in Balch Springs. But for Teresa and her kids, this is simply home. There's always a silver lining and always lessons to be learned. In Balch Springs, Hannah Davis, Channel 8 News. The news in Virginia is still developing at this hour. You can always check your WFAA app for the latest information. You'll find it for free in your app store.